Good morning, everyone. <clears throat> Here is a little segment to say hi. It is um, ten o'clock. No, nine o'clock in the morning. Um, the one clock is still on the old time, so it's nine o'clock in the morning. I already uh, shipped some Christmas letters. Um, I did my workout today. I started again. Maybe some of you know I started to work out in the summer two to three times a week and it was so good. It was so good. Then I went on vacation and you know, I don't know, that breaks my routine. I, if I go on vacations or if I get sick or something and then I do something, I don't do something for a while, it's so hard to get back into this routine and I really would like to go back to it. Um, I had, I had or have, I don't know yet, migraine for several uh, days straight now i think i'm on day five four or five and I, I i don't know if my pain that i have now is only my sore head or if it's um still migraine pain i can't make a difference at, at the moment um so i thought maybe it's already in the muscles you know you you get so cramped when you got make migraine so i thought maybe workout would be helpful and <laughs> so funny you can see it wait yeah he's very curious so then i took a shower had my breakfast um i was setting up my new bullet journal today <clears throat> well i started to setting it up today yesterday no yesterday in the evening i did a little bit today in the morning, but it takes me a few days because I don't like to do it in one sitting. <clears throat> and after I have set up everything, before I fill it with my private notes and dates and so on, I will take some photos and I'm not sure yet <clears throat> if I put them into the next Vlogmas episode or so, but I will show you quickly my setup for everyone who is interested in it. Um, so you have an inspiration if you want to start your own bullet journal the next year. But keep in mind, you can start all the time. You can start in March with a new bullet journal, okay? You don't have to stress yourself and think, oh, January 1st is so close. I have to do everything now and have everything figured out by the first day of the new year. That's not true. You can start over at any given day. Now, Benny and I, <laughs> we'll go <coughs> for a walk and after that I have to do the last shipping from the last order I had in my shop I have to bake the new year's cakes you saw me prepping the dough yesterday um, it's a northern German tradition to bake these cakes they look like ice cones but they are much thinner so I don't think that they would hold too Scoops of ice, is scoop the right word? Uh, ice cream, sorry, scoops of ice cream. Uh, we eat them without anything or with whipped cream. Mm. Oh, good that I say it now. I still have to buy cream, <laughs> heavy cream. I forgot this yesterday. And what else? Today there isn't so much to do, but tomorrow there is the last cleaning to do, the last uh, shopping for Benny's food. <laughs> and all these things. I'm sure I will find several things to do today. But these are the things they have to get done today. And I will take you with me. Okay, let's go for a walk and see what I do next. Maybe the baking. I could do the baking next. Okay, see ya.
while the vlogmas files for the today's video so the one i will upload today <clears throat> is transferring to my pc i will grab the dog walk the dog and afterwards i will make a cup of coffee and slowly but steady the christmas calm sets in here because my to-do to -do list is getting shorter and shorter the new year's cakes are baked the christmas christmas presents are all wrapped even the tiny ones for colleagues and the giveaways for family gatherings and so on <clears throat> that means i can have fun today I returned home from walking the dog and I finished the laundry, ironing, the hemmed bottom ups or button down, button downs, or no, I think it's button down, right? <laughs> what men wear. So women wear a blouse and men are wearing, I think, button downs. Well, I think you can tell, I'm, I'm sure you will tell me in the comments down below. So the laundry is um, done, the baking is done. And I completely forgot to open the pattern advent calendar, the sock pattern advent calendar. And I wanted to tell you that yesterday I was able to knit three squares into my scrappy pillow cover. That means if I knit two squares every day the main knitting is done by christmas eve and i only have to knit this short border and attach the snaps and close everything so with an easy seam i crochet it together yeah i think i crocheted it together last time so let's have a look into the pattern book okay the last time i opened it was december 15th <laughs> so we have five patterns left let's have a look at 16 Oh, it's not a sock, it's um, a pair of slippers. And day 17. Oh, I really like that. It's mosaic, a mosaic pattern, and it looks like slip stitches. So not um stranded knitting <laughs> okay that was 17 now we come to 18 <laughs> benny is putting his head into my knitting basket heimlich oh that is a great german word you can't translate to english homey probably so home like home that was 18 now we come to 19 oh they call it elf shoes <laughs> and the today's pattern for the 20th that uh, rose hips it's called i think knospe is hip in english i hope <laughs> and that is really really pretty Ooh, i like that okay um let me brew a cup of coffee and knit a square into my pillow cover now <laughs> 